Pick Six brought to you by Davidson's Liquors. And yesterday, our subject was the Broncos' best ever value picks in the draft. Oh. For instance, Carl Mecklenburg was a 12th rounder. Sure. Tyrone Braxton was a 12th rounder. They went Shannon on their nice careers. Shannon Before Char, I mentioned TD, Terrell TD, Davis. Sixth rounder, yeah. I said Jason Needham, who was a third round pick, who yeah. sure. set all the records and won yeah. a bunch of games with Today, the, the subject, and you think about this, today the subject is just the best Broncos picks ever from a talent standpoint. So you, you include value, you include the career they had eventually, you, you, you include their, their Pro Bowl talent, the number of times they, they went and to the I Pro Bowl. And I think Bowls. this is going to be harder than people think. When, when I was going through it, I went, you know, you could go a lot of different directions with this. Right. You're yeah. first. Okay. And I start with number six and work my way up to number one. Six best Bronco draft picks of all time. Number six would be Shannon Sharp. You go, oh, he's got to be better than that, but... I think if you follow along, you'll understand my <laughs> reasoning. Uh, we know what Shen, Hall of Famer, right. low drown pick. He was the, one rounder. of the three or four best tight ends in the history of the league. Yeah. That had to be a great draft pick. Number five would be Terrell Davis. For a four or five year career, I said yesterday, one of the greatest running backs. He was the greatest running back for four years, won two Super Bowls, won an MVP in, right. in, in the first Super Bowl they won. He was unstoppable. He, had, he would have 200 yards, 180 yards. That playoff game when he was blind because of his migraine. The Super Bowl. Migraine, yeah. That's in the Super Bowl. Green Bay. Yeah, number four. He's come a little far. Floyd Little. And oh. I think he, Floyd Little made this franchise. Two-minute warning. That was the first number one draft choice they ever signed. Oh. People don't really get that. But he made this franchise no longer a joke because he became, and, and here's a quick story about Floyd Little, uh, playing for, for, for uh, Saban, Lou Saban. Uh, at the end of the half, Saban said, get out of the game. You're not playing. In fact, I want you to change out of your uniform and go away. Uh, second half started. Floyd paid no attention to him, went back out on the field and had a great second half. And from then on, Floyd Little was a great player, and he's made the Hall of Fame. Yeah. So that's that's a great draft pick. You'd think that might be at the top, but they drafted Dick Butkus. Did uh, you know that? I didn't know that. He went and signed with the NFL. He was a great draft pick. Great pick. Just a lousy well, into 1965, it. 1965, he was a second-round draft pick. Wow. Only because there were only eight teams in the AFL. Oh, he was gotcha. the ninth pick overall. Gotcha. Yeah, number two. So that was a great draft pick. Tim Tebow. What? There has never been. I knew you would. We but, hadn't mentioned him for uh, almost two hours. This is like the way Tebow played. There has. He only comes comes back in the last two minutes of the game. There has never been a draft pick in the history. Stop it. <laughs> Don't do that. There has me. never been a draft pick in the history of the Broncos that has caused. Do you know that Time Magazine has picked Saddam Hussein as the man of the year? They picked Hitler in the 30s as the man of the year. The man of the year doesn't necessarily mean that it's a great honor. Yeah, right. Uh, that's been proven over and over again. Tim Tebow was the most incredible draft choice the Broncos have ever had for a lot of reasons. Why isn't he number one? Because Ooh. number one is Randy Gratishar. Wow. Logs in the Hall of Fame. He was a number one draft pick, knee injury out of Ohio State. He drifted down the draft. If they could get a guy like Randy Gratishar, for 10 years, and I fought to get him in the Hall of Fame and failed, uh, for 10 years, he's the only guy in the history of the NFL that had more than 100 tackles in 10 consecutive years. And, and he was they the were 14 game seasons when yep. he played. For most of the time. Yeah. They went to, but the other thing about him, there's never been in history anybody that was better at defending third and one, fourth and inches yep. than Randy Gratishar. That's the best number one draft pick they've ever had. Cool. Okay, those are Woody's six picks. Now my six picks brought to you by Davidson's Liquors. In no particular order, by the way. Number six. What? For Why me. Why is it in a particular order? order? It's too hard. Okay. 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 Every, 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 <laughs> isn't that what you're supposed to do is put it in a six? Okay. Number six. Uh, Alex. <laughs> 
Here's my question, in no particular order. <laughs> is it Hong Kong or Paris or London? Number six. Oh, I'm sorry, Les. I'm Carl, sorry. You lost your money. Carl <laughs> Mecklenburg, who was a 12th rounder and went on to have a number of Pro Bowl seasons. And you, that so came you in 1983. Oh, number five. This is my turn now. Quiet. Oh, and I'm just trying to wonder, so there's no Chris particular. Hinton. And you know why? Why? Because if they don't take Chris Hinton, Indianapolis maybe doesn't make that, or Baltimore maybe doesn't make that trade with the Broncos and sends John Elway here. They wanted Chris Hinton on the offensive line. Sure. The Broncos made him the fourth pick in the draft. Baltimore wanted him. They made the Elway deal. Number four. You just that, pissed that, that you didn't think of that. That is, one. no, that is. Merlin Olsen, that another is, one you didn't that think is of. Revision, <laughs> Merlin Olsen. That's revisionist Hall of Fame, history. Defensive you line. You and I go talk about that For the Rams, that who was taken in the first round by the Broncos in 1962 and never signed here, but it was a hell of a pick. Great greatest broadcaster. Greatest Mormon pick ever by the Broncos. <laughs> oh, yeah. Number three. The greatest is guy that ended up Dick on little, Buckus. little House on the Prairie. That's yeah. right. That's right. Dick Buckus, for all the reasons we talked about before. Number the greatest two. Greatest draft pick that ever represented Flowers, RTD Flowers. <laughs> Shannon Sharp, a three-time Super Bowl winner. Re- <laughs> retired, retired with every major tight end record possible and uh, was picked in the seventh round. That's a hell of greatest a Greatest bearded. And number one, everybody. the man who made it possible for the Broncos to win two Super Bowls, Terrell Davis, he took the pressure off Elway and off the defense. He is my number one Broncos draft no, pick you said of in, all time. You said there was no order. Randomly. He could be sixth throw. I changed we know. my mind. Okay, all right. <laughs> uh, do you have one or two that we didn't? Maybe no, I like Woody's list. <laughs> <laughs> Can you see this right here? Can you see that? All right, that's our pick six brought to you by Davidson's Liquors. Uh, fans of the sports show, this very show, can get $10 off any online order of what? $50 or more. Yeah, you can get up to 20% off. $10 off any order of $50 or more. Go to DavidsonsDenver.com. Use the promo code, pay attention, okay. Sports Show 10 This offer is good for online orders only. They can be delivered, or you can pick them up in the store. It's available at Den- DavidsonsDenver.com. That's DavidsonsDenver.com. Use the coupon code SPORTSSHOW10. 